Hey, what's up amigos? Today I'm going to show you how to replace a sky in Adobe Photoshop. Right, so uh, one of the problems that I run into is when I shoot a car, the sky is just so boring. Replacing a sky would really make a dramatic uh, change to the way the photo look. So today we're going to replace this guy with one of the images that I found over the internet and we're going to slightly color balance it with a um, selective color adjustment layer. Alright so let's get started. First let's transform this image to fit the original photo. So somewhere around here would be fine and let's position it closely to the horizon somewhere around here you can drop the opacity down a bit like so yeah I think it's it's fine all right here's the trick double click on the layer that should bring out the layer style what we're going to use is the blend F for more information about the Blend F layer, uh, check out the link in the description below. Alright, so we're going to select the blue and we're going to use the underlaying layer slider. We're going to slide to the right. And as you can see, it's uh, doing a pretty amazing job. Oh. Now, to fine tune this, Hold Alt and drag the slider just slightly, like so. And let's have a look. Well, it looks good to me. We're going to fix this in a bit with a layer mask. So click OK. Let's add a layer mask with a brush. And we're going to brush this out. So anywhere that you find stuff that you'd like to mask out, just brush it with a with a black brush and that should mask it out. There you go, that was really easy and fast. No need to use the pen tool or any other complex uh, ways that would work really perfectly now i'm looking at it i mean the the photo looks good but i don't like the blues in the uh the sky image that we got so i'm going to add an adjustment layer oh, come on and it's going to be a selective color and we're going to target the blues so select the blues and um, mainly i'm going to use the magenta slider and i'm going to slide a bit to the left and uh, yeah let's let's just move the yellow slide over to the right let's do the same thing with the science just to see what's gonna happen kind of like it the way it is what you can also do if it's overly saturated Let's just make sure it's tied up to this layer. I'm going to add a hue and saturation, and I'm going to uh, tie it to this layer below, which is the sky. And I might just desaturate a bit. This is like too much. Somewhere around here would be just fine. And that's it, amigos. Look at that. It looks so totally different right now. I hope that was helpful again. Up until the next video. See you later, amigos.